Welcome everybody to our video series called Campus Corner. It's meant to show you some places around the campus and some faces from computational engineering. My name is Tariq al -Wusabi. I'm from Yemen. I'm a senior in computational engineering, almost done, and my background is civil engineering. Let me introduce you to my favorite spot on campus. We are now in the engineering building in the Office of Student Council. My relationship with this beautiful place started when I was the president. I took my job really seriously, so I started spending a lot of time here. I conducted meetings with colleagues, planning events and everything in this room. And then I took it a step further. I started studying here because it's really calm, really nice. No one really comes here. You don't find a lot of students around. So it was the perfect place to, uh, to study. I started spending a lot of time here and it's a really nice place. Student Council is a group of students who are elected by other colleagues to represent the computational engineering officially. We make events, we made uh, trips, and we have like uh, yearly or every semester talks with professors to discuss like problems and stuff according the, uh, regarding to courses. So I really advise you to go for it and be a part of that institution. It's very good and you get a lot of experience because you work closely with the computational engineering support team and uh, closely also with management. It's a, an amazing experience. Hello and welcome to students of computational engineering. My name is Klaus Ackel. I'm director of the computational engineering program and in ordinary life I'm a professor of mechanics and materials and you see me here in my office. We are here in the building of the Faculty of Civil and Environmental Engineering. Uh, most of the courses you are going to have will be taught by members of this faculty. So I was asked to show you my favorite place at uh, the Ruhr University. And actually, this is my office where we are now. I think it's very nice. If you look at the window, we have this high uh, ceilings here, so it has kind of feeling of an old mansion a little bit. It's very shady, so in summer it's always cool here. Otherwise, it's uh, full of memories, of uh, gifts, of little things I've collected. You see this pictures here, they are from uh, my uh, teaching in Vietnam. Uh, here, for example, this is the gift of the first compact intake in Vietnam of the students. If you walk around, here we have R2D2, cast and concrete. Here's my name in Chinese uh, from a Chinese conference. Here we have a statue of a Vietnamese musician. That's a present from Tongchi University in China, I got. And I have all my books here. What's special of computational engineering? Well, it's a mixture of applied mechanics, applied mathematics, computer science and application. And I think this mixture is very special. When we started with computational engineering now a little more than 20 years ago, we were pioneers, we were more or less the first program in Germany. Now, of course, uh, there are copies all around, people doing the same, but uh, in some sense we are the original. A tip for you for the first semester how to start, try to stay in contact, just don't be for your own alone because this might be very frustrating. The second tip, computational engineering is a very hard, a very demanding program. So don't get the idea that you are too stupid to study it. At the beginning, there are always things that you don't understand, but this is like it's for everyone. It was for me like this when I started my studies. Don't get frustrated. You need a little bit of endurance and I promise you it will get better. exercises in mechanical modeling of material in the first semester. 
I already studied uh, computational engineering and uh, now I'm doing PhD in the chair of continuum mechanics with Professor Balzani. My PhD topic is material properties identification at the macro and micro scale. Uh, now I am standing in one of my favorite spots in the campus, it's behind Menza. I like it very much because wherever you look uh, you see a uh, green uh, area. On the right side uh, there are the engineering uh, buildings and the uh, natural sciences and uh, on the left there are, there are the medicine and the languages. Uh, I like this place very much uh, because it's very calm. Um, you can always take your food from Menza, come sit here uh, and enjoy the nature. Hi guys, I'm Lavanya, Lavanya Gauri Sundar. I'm from India, Bangalore. Uh, I'm doing my uh, third semester in Comping. I just finished my second. A little about my background, I'm from civil engineering. I did my bachelor's in civil engineering from India. Uh, so how was the transition between civil engineering bachelor's to Comping master's? So civil, you study a lot about materials and things like that. And once you're in Comping, uh, it's an all new different environment. So you start a little with mechanics and a lot of uh, coding and a lot of math so do your math guys don't don't compromise on your math a little about where i'm standing now uh, in front of me is the humanities department behind me is the medicine faculty and behind that is our engineering faculty where you would mostly spend all your time what i actually like about this place is this cuest i am a big foodie also a vegan. So this is an amazing place guys. You can just come here, laze around for a bit, have your lunch and then again go back and attend classes. There are many comping memories that I can share with you guys. Starting from a Halloween party once we came here and then the movie park and uh, the museum tour. Everything was so good. I can recollect bonding with other friends from comping and it's, it's like a whole family now. From the professors to the support staff to my friends. It's like a family now guys. Uh, I'm sure you guys will also come to this family soon. A virtual welcome to all of you. Uh, see you soon and welcome again to uh, our family of comping. Virtual hugs until then.